Hello everyone, you are in Endurance Laser Lab. Today I want to show you how to connect your Endurance add-on laser box to your laser model. So if you have already 10 watt laser, so you go, uh, have it like this, a uh, laser control board and a laser uh, diode inserted into aluminum housing. So to connect your laser box, you just simply need to take these wires, uh, cut wires from laser control board, wire them, solder, and you're ready to go. Uh, because laser box has the same functions as a laser control board plus voltmeter, voltmeter and diameter, um, DC-DC converter plus Arduino. So, like I said, it's very simple. Just cut these wires, wire new black and white with a laser and you're ready to go. If you want to measure temperature, this temperature sensor you can simply insert here into a heatsink and you may use special paste, thermal paste. So that's that's very very simple, won't be any problem. So I'll remove this and we'll show you what do you need to know if you have another modification, for example 3.5 watt laser. So if you have 3.5 watt laser, uh, you need to remove the laser diode from here, so you just need to unscrew these uh, four screws here and unsolder the laser diode that is inserted into a heatsink. So you, you need to get connection to this laser diode. Uh, then you can still use this jack and uh, you need to use it because the power that goes from the jack will go to the fan. But now you can use like 12 volts and only one amp or something like that. So you need power only for a fan. So as soon as you unsolder your uh, laser diode that is uh, inserted into your heatsink, let's put it like, like this, uh, you need to connect uh, black and red with the laser diode. So uh, let me show you how you can do this with uh, with connections. Uh, like this. Okay. I'm just going to show you up. Oops. Okay. It's done. It's not connected, so don't worry. And connect your laser. Okay, and red. Please do not miss polarity, it's very important. We don't have any protection on these laser diodes. So. Okay, red. Okay. We are all set, so they are connected. And if you want to measure power, uh, sorry, temperature, normally you just simply insert it into any any holes that are here. And also you may use the thermal paste glue. And yeah, now we are ready to go. But um, we are going to make very very quick test because the laser uh, diode is not inserted into heatsink, so uh, the temperature will go up pretty quickly so let's run it let's make sure why do you have it so it's off we press a button and we see 2 amps 12 volts okay. so now it's working and you may use your laser box so hope that you like this video, please share it with your friends and try our endurance laser box or laser box kit, it's up to you, you may also assemble it, you just need to print out this, this form, we have different designs and even if you have any other laser, you're also welcome to use our laser box with your, your laser. So hope that you like it, please share it with your friends and subscribe on our channel, bye bye!